son of a bitch. Jen, this isn't the time. You're firing me? Where the hell do you get off? Frankly, it's overdue. Your behavior in the last two years has been completely erratic. Erratic? Recently, you don't even show an interest in your work. You smoke constantly in your office. You spend most of the day online shopping. You disappear for hours at a time, sometimes days, always saying you're visiting your sister in Scottsdale. You go to Scranton far more often than you need to. Is it to. because of these? Whoa, is hey, it? whoa, no. Jan. I want to know. I want to know. Because if it is, then, then, then I will see you in court. It's not. No. It's not. Because he likes them. Okay? He likes them. And, and that, is, that is all I care about. The time has come for you to end your professional relationship with this company. You are clearly unstable. Hey, you're unstable. Yeah. No. We're all unstable. Okay, some, you know some, what? I'm just everybody. not leaving. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving. David? I did not tell her. Can I help you? I need you to make me a hundred copies of this on Canary Yellow. Hey, Jan. Hi. How's the candle game? Oh, great. Yeah, Serenity by Jan is kicking ass and taking names. <laughs> you remember last week when that girl went missing? Guess whose candles they used for the vigil? Cool. Thank God they found her, too. Oh, they found her? Hey, Jan. Hello, baby. How are you? Good to see you. Who's your daddy? You don't know who your daddy is, do you? No, you don't. Come on. Let's go in. When Michael told us that Jan was pregnant, he led us to believe that he was the father by telling us that he was the father. Hey, Oscar, who's that woman in Michael's office with the feet? That's his ex. Oh, she's, she's very beautiful. Yes, she is, and clinically insane. Jan. Hi, Jim. What do we have here? Ah, oh, this is my baby. Really? <laughs> oh, no. Jan had the baby, and Michael wasn't there to mark it. So the baby could be anybody's. Except Michael's. Have a seat. Um, she will be right in. <laughs> oh, great. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you mind telling me her name? I realize we don't have it. Uh, she'll be right in. Okay, great. She... Okay. Just a little off the top, and then a nice combing. Yeah. Just comb it. Oh my god. It's Jan. Oh, dear God in heaven. Jan used to be one of my superiors, and she is one of the most erratic and terrifying people I have ever met. You son of a bitch. You're firing me? You. Where the hell do you get off? Jim and I are pretty sure she had an affair with her ex-assistant, Hunter. He was 17. But she looks great. If she asks, will you tell her I said that? Forget everything we taught you. Kevin, where are you? You missed my song, buddy. Yeah, Michael, I'm at Garrity's. You have to come down here. Just pay for it and we'll reimburse you when you get back. No, I, I brought my money. Michael, there's something that you need to see. What is it? Just hurry. Is he okay? Yeah, he's at the supermarket. He needs me. You know, the party, driving to the supermarket, it's a big day for him. Yeah, that's true. Don't move a muscle. I will be back momentarily, all right? No, you can drink. You finish your drink and then I'll, okay, I'll be back. Good to see you. It was great to yeah. see you, Jan. Oh, yeah. oh okay. Oh, hello, Jan. Hello, Michael. Wow, Kevin, really? We're, yeah. sorry, we're in the middle of a party. Is this why you called me down here? Yeah, Michael, I just, uh, I, I think you kids have a lot to catch up on. Oh, okay. Yeah. Thanks, Kevin. Um, Michael? Michael? 
Michael. This car's not in the parking lot. I should check the accident reports. Who's this? Jan. Being good isn't always easy, no matter how hard I try. When he started sweet talking to me, he'd come and tell me everything is all right. He'd kiss and tell me everything is all right. And can I get away again tonight? The only one. Uh, it's, get right to the point, okay. you know. Um, I, I, I feel good about myself for the first time in a really long time. Mm. And I've made some big changes in my life, and I miss you. I want us to go back together. Do you excuse me for a second? Oh, no. DEFCON 20. She wants to get back together. What are you going to do? I don't know. That's why you're here. Help me. Do you want to get back together with no, her? No. No. What do I do? Just don't get back together with her. What if she makes me? How can she make you get back together with she her? She made me do a lot of things I didn't want to do. This was a terrible relationship. You were not happy when you were with her. I wasn't. You're so much happier now. Just go in there and be strong. You're right. You are absolutely right. I need to go in there and tell her that we can't be together. Right. Wow. Do it. I'm in a very good place right now. Okay. Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> Jan? We need to talk. Oh my god. No, in the beginning, we were not good. Well, there was a bit of a learning curve in the conversation department, but between the sheets, we were like Jordan and Pippin. Well, if there's anything exciting about it, it was because we both knew it was wrong. Because we worked together. No, okay, imagine there's a princess who falls for a guy beneath her station, and the queen doesn't like this at all. And the princess knows that the queen doesn't like it, and so it makes her want to do it all the more just to get at the queen. Am I the princess? No, I'm the princess and the queen. Okay, so I'm the guy at the station. Mommy! Azzy! Oh, how was school? It was good. What did you learn? What did I learn? You might have learned shapes, or blocks, or clocks, or colors, or you might have learned that we're all sisters and brothers. I have herpes. Well, you 